Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you uh, how to write this uh, geometric series and summation notation. So you can see I have summation notation right here, as well as the nth rule uh, for any geometric sequence or series. So uh, what we notice about this you know, series is this continues on forever. And that's going to be very important when we look at summation notation, because summation notation pretty much has you know, our general rule. Um, where we're going to start and then end, which is like our upper limit. Well, since this series never, since it's a series and, it, and the rule never, the sequ like never stops, this value is going to be infinity. So we'll have, we're going to start at one and then we're going to go up to infinity. Ah, so got it. All right. So now what we need to do is determine what exactly is the rule. So we need to determine a sub one. Well, we know a sub one. That's cool. Uh, we know it's a 2, we know it's a 3, but we'd have to continue on and on and on and on forever to find the rest of the term. So that's going to be kind of difficult. Um, so, but we know a sub 1, and that's really the most important thing. a sub 1 is 0.5. Now, what we need to do is determine what our r is. And again, to determine our r, we just take any value in our sequence series and divide it by its previous term to determine the ratio. So that's going to be a sub 2 divided by a sub 1. So all I'm simply going to do is take 0 0.05 divided by 0.5. And one thing I can do is just multiply by um, 10 over this to help me out with this. So I can say that's 50, um, I'm sorry, 5 over 50. Right? You just move the decimal point over on the top and on the bottom. Um, and then you could say, um, you know, 5 means 50, that's going to be 1 tenth. And that's going to be raised to the n minus 1. So, and pretty much you look at that, you know, does that make sense, 1 tenth? To go from here, you're multiplying by 1 tenth, which is like dividing by 10, right? Yes, that works. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you write your geometric sequence in summation notation. Thanks.